Hello there, viewers, it's time to saddle up and venture into the exciting world of West America facts once again. Get ready for a riveting journey as we unravel the captivating story of a true Old West legend, Pat Garrett. Whether you're a history buff with a soft spot for the Wild West, or simply enjoy a good old tale of frontier justice, you're in for a treat. So, grab your hats and tighten those bootstraps, because we're about to embark on a thrilling ride through history. All right, partner, here's the scoop. Pat Garrett was no ordinary lawman. He was the real deal, a hero straight out of the Wild West playbook. Picture dusty towns, fierce shootouts, and the pursuit of justice against all odds. Pat Garrett's story is like a page from a gripping adventure novel, and we're about to turn those pages together. So, join us as we mosey on back in time to discover how this legendary figure became a symbol of frontier law and order. It's gonna be a rootin' tootin' good time. Once upon a time, nestled in the heart of America, a man named Pat Garrett called the vibrant state of Alabama his birthplace. But it was the warm, welcoming arms of Louisiana that cradled him through his formative years. Pat, a spirited young lad of merely 17, felt an irresistible tug in his heart. His dreams beckoned him westward, towards the uncharted, wild frontiers of Texas. You see, Pat harbored a deep-seated yearning for the life of a cowboy and the thrill of being a buffalo hunter. The year 1879 marked a remarkable turn in Pat's life. It was the year he discovered something truly precious, love. Fueled by this newfound affection, he embarked on a journey to create a home in a distant land known as Lincoln County, New Mexico. This expedition wasn't a walk in the park, it was a test of his courage and determination. However, Pat was no stranger to adventure, and with a heart brimming with enthusiasm, he carved out a place for himself in this new territory. Initially, he donned the badge of a deputy sheriff, dedicating himself to maintaining peace in the rugged, frontier towns of the county. Little did he know, life had grander designs in store for him. Pat Garrett's story is one that resonates with the spirit of the American frontier where dreams were pursued with unyielding determination, and where love could be found amidst the wild expanse of the West. As Pat's journey unfolds, we'll discover how this young man's pursuit of his cowboy dreams led him to become one of the most renowned figures in the history of the American West. His adventures and challenges, set against the backdrop of Lincoln County, New Mexico, are a testament to the indomitable human spirit and the boundless possibilities that await those willing to chase their dreams. Join us as we follow Pat Garrett's path through the untamed frontier, where each twist and turn reveals a new chapter in his gripping tale. On a fateful July day in 1881, Pat Garrett found himself on an unwavering pursuit, hot on the trail of a notorious outlaw who went by the name of Billy the Kid. This young renegade had managed to slip through the fingers of justice, leaving a trail of turmoil and trepidation in his wake. However, Pat was a man of unwavering resolve, a character who would not shy away from the most daunting challenges. Under the searing sun that blazed across the desert sky, Pat tirelessly tracked the elusive Billy the Kid, his heart pounding with every determined step he took. The haunting whisper of the wind through the sagebrush served as a constant reminder of the vast and untamed terrain that was his beloved homeland. It was on the dusty, sun-scorched soil of the American West that these two men would collide in a dramatic showdown, a moment that would forever stand still in the annals of history. As the day unfolded, the tension in the air was palpable. Pat Garrett and Billy the Kid stood face to face, their destinies intertwined in that pivotal instant. The West held its breath, and time itself seemed to pause as these two formidable figures locked eyes in a test of courage, determination, and fate that would shape the course of their lives and echo through the ages. Give it up, Billy. Pat said with a steely gaze, your time is up. In the scorching heat of the Wild West, tensions simmered like a pot about to boil over. All eyes were on Billy, a man known for his lightning-quick draw, as he faced off against Pat Garrett. It was a moment pregnant with anticipation, like the charged air before a thunderstorm, making the hairs on the back of your neck stand on end. The entire scene seemed to hold its breath. And then, with a speed that defied belief, Shots pierced the silence. The bullets ripped through the desert air, sending clouds of dust into a frenzied dance. As the dust slowly settled, the impossible became reality. Pat Garrett stood tall and victorious, 
The man who was once the terror of the West had been brought down by a single determined lawman. It was a showdown that would echo through history. The news of Pat's incredible bravery spread like wildfire, carried by whispers and stories that traveled from town to town. He became a living legend, the embodiment of a lone gunslinger who had tamed the untamed frontier with nothing but unwavering resolve and his trusty six-shooter. But little did folks know that Pat's journey was far from its final chapter. The Wild West had many more surprises in store for this fearless hero. After his incredible act of heroism, Pat Garrett decided to embark on a new adventure, ranching. In 1882, he packed up his dreams and headed west to Roswell, New Mexico. Picture this. Vast, endless plains as far as the eye could see, where the soothing serenity of the rolling land embraced Pat like an old friend. Here, amid the rugged beauty of the southwest, he traded in his gun for a shepherd's crook. Days were filled with tending to his cattle, and nights were illuminated by the star-studded New Mexican skies. Life was simpler, life was good. Yet, fate had other plans for Pat. In 1896, the call of the law echoed louder than ever, drawing him back into its unyielding grasp. Dona Ana County, New Mexico, became the backdrop for his return to the badge. It seemed that the law was etched into Pat's very soul, an unbreakable bond that defied time and distance. Soon enough, he climbed the ranks, becoming the sheriff, the guardian of justice in this untamed land. The story of Pat Garrett was far from over. It was just taking a thrilling new turn. For a long time, Pat Garrett was the unwavering symbol of law and order on the dusty streets of Dona Ana County. His presence commanded respect from many, but in the wild world of lawmen and outlaws, friendships were as fragile as old parchment. Alongside the accolades, Pat had collected his fair share of adversaries. Then came the unexpected twist in the tale. The year 1902 brought a new chapter into Pat's life. He was handed the role of collector of customs in a bustling place known as El Paso, Texas. It wasn't a job for the faint of heart. Pat's duty was to oversee the constant ebb and flow of goods and people traversing the border into the United States. Diligence was Pat's middle name, and he approached this new responsibility with the same unflinching commitment. As the collector of customs, Pat Garrett's days were filled with a whirlwind of activity. He stood at the crossroads of cultures, a guardian of the border. Pat ensured that trade flowed smoothly, like a well-oiled machine, while keeping a watchful eye on those who sought to bend the rules. His reputation for fairness and integrity grew even stronger in this new role, earning him admiration from both sides of the border. In the midst of the chaos, Pat Garrett remained an enigmatic figure, a symbol of resilience and duty. His story wasn't just about the pursuit of outlaws, it was also about a man who adapted to the changing tides of life. Whether on the dusty streets of Dona Ana County, or the bustling border town of El Paso, Pat's journey was a testament to the unyielding spirit of those who uphold the law. His legacy continued to echo through time, a reminder that even in a world of shifting allegiances, some values remain constant, honor, justice, and the unwavering commitment to safeguarding the rule of law. But as the years passed, Pat's heart longed for the open plains and the freedom of the ranch. He decided to buy a horse ranch, a place where he could reconnect with the land he loved. He leased the ranch to a man named Wayne Brazel, believing that he had found a trustworthy tenant. However, fate had one final, tragic twist in store for Pat Garrett. A dispute over the lease of the ranch turned heated, like a smoldering fire waiting to ignite. And then, on a fateful day, as Pat was traveling from the ranch to a place called Las Cruces, New Mexico, tragedy struck. A gunshot shattered the silence of the desert road, and Pat Garrett fell to the ground, his life slipping away like sand through an hourglass. Wayne Brazel, the man who had leased the ranch, claimed that Pat had drawn a gun on him, and the killing was an act of self-defense. A witness agreed, and Wayne Brazel walked away a free man. But the air was heavy with suspicion, like a storm cloud that refused to dissipate. Many believed that there was more to Pat Garrett's death than met the eye that perhaps someone had conspired to bring down the lawman who had made so many enemies. And so, the legend of Pat Garrett lived on, not just as a man who had brought down Billy the Kid, but as a man whose life was a testament to the untamed spirit of the Wild West. In the end, 
whether it was justice or something more sinister that claimed his life. One thing was certain. Pat Garrett's name would forever be etched into the annals of the Wild West, a place where legends were born and lived on, like the wind that whispered through the sagebrush. Thanks for watching our video on the origins of Pat Garrett, the legendary Old West lawman. We hope you enjoyed learning about his fascinating journey from a young cowboy to a renowned sheriff. Now we want to hear from you. What are your thoughts on Pat Garrett's story? Did you find it inspiring or intriguing? Please leave a comment below, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more exciting content like this. Your feedback means the world to us, and it helps us create more engaging videos for you. Thanks again for being a part of our community, and we'll see you in the next video.